What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In this video, I want to first of all uh, show you a quick little tutorial on how to set your bot status. Um, so for example, right here, how it says play in wallpaper engine, which is, if you guys didn't know, that's how I get these cool backgrounds. Um, you can get wallpaper engine through Steam and you can download it and have cool backgrounds like this and stuff like that. Uh, so I'm going to show you how to uh, add so your bot can show or you can customize your bot saying something. So playing uh, something or whatever, you can customize this with your bot. So it's going to be a quick tutorial. And then I'm going to go after that, I'm going to go over uh, some things that I have to talk with you guys about. Uh, and hopefully uh, you guys will understand the future of this channel. And yeah, basically I'll talk about it after I'm done with the tutorial. So again, welcome back. This is where we kind of left off last time around. What I think we did, yeah, we sent attachments. That was my last video. Uh, so it's gonna be quick. Here we go. It's gonna be very basic. One second, I'm gonna move my mic a little bit. There we go. Uh, very simple on how to set your uh, the bot status. And what you're gonna do is in your bot ready, the little command that we have here where it logs into the console, the bot is online. Um, when the bot is ready, what you have to do is going to go into bot dot oh my phone went off bot dot user I'm sorry user that activity a set activity actually set activity and then in here you can say uh is playing what gonna be a cool game to play uh pack man world 2 something like that and basically what's gonna happen if you run your bot you can come here and press or type node space dots. A lot of people were having trouble with node space dot and I kind of completely forgot to tell you guys, um, but that's one of the commands. So what you can do here is on scripts, you can come here into your package.json for your scripts. You can type node space dots um, and then a little semicolon then the other two of these. Actually, I have to put a comma at the end of the last. So here we go. Um, and then what you can do is you can say, uh, let's see, what's the main file name? Index.js. So you can do uh, node run index.js. Basically, type this on your package.json. Make sure you put a comma here at the end, and you should be, you know, running with node. Basically, your scripts is the commands, a short command. Uh, so when I do node space dot, it basically runs node run index.js. So we do node space dot, bot is online, and if we come here to our bot, we'll see that plain Pac-Man World 2. Uh, you can actually customize this a little bit more. So instead of plain, there are a couple things that you can have. Uh, with Discord.js, there's four that can come. Uh, so you can change plain to streaming, uh, to listening, and to watching. So to do that, what we can do is come here. Uh, we can... Leave these as this. So let's say it's going to be streaming pack in world two. You're going to put a comma. After comma, you're going to put the bra two brackets. And for that, we're going to do type and then a uh, colon. And then here for the type, uh, you can choose one of these four types. So we got listening, playing, streaming, watching. Make sure to capitalize. So for me, I'm going to do streaming. And I'm going to do some, some good old uh, error catching just in case we ever get an error. So let's just console.log. Console uh, error. Oh, sorry. Console log. Sorry. I'm typing this on console that error. There we go. So let's close this. Open it up again. And go into Discord, and you see actually. See the one problem with doing this is since the bot doesn't go offline, it takes a while for the bot to go offline uh, and to recognize it's offline. It'll take some time to uh, to do this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait here until it goes offline and then try it. Be right back, guys. So welcome back. Um, kind of figure out the problem, and it really wasn't that the bot was offline because it still says playing Pac-Man World 2. Um, and the thing is, there's actually a problem currently with Discord.js. I don't think it's necessarily our problem. 
I did misspell this, so it should be, uh, instead of that, should be streaming. So it should be uh, this. Um, but when I run it, you'll see that it will still say plain. So the streaming one is broken currently. Maybe it's for me, try it for you. Um, but if you do something like listening, so if you do uh, listening, if I can just keep spelling, I always get messed up when it's all caps. Then you can come here and it'll be listening to pack and roll two. Uh, so the streaming is the one that is, you know, I'm having trouble with. So you can actually do watching. Again, there's playing, streaming, listening, and watching. So I'm guessing there's a, currently a problem with streaming with Discord.js. So there's watching Pac-Man World 2. Um, but maybe it's just me. So try typing streaming here. And if it works for you, then sure, uh, go for it. If you want to make, if you're making your own like streaming bot or something like that, then it kind of would be helpful if it says, uh, you know, streaming blah, 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 or something, or streaming, or watching, and then your Discord link or something. Um, I'm not your Discord, sorry, your Twitch link, or your DLive, or whatever, where you stream. You can have your bot say streaming, or watching uh, your own stream. So that could be helpful, a little advertisement. So that's basically all for today. I know, again, it was a short thing. It's just, uh, this is a little bit more customizable. Uh, but I want to talk about some things. Um, first thing, I know I have not been uploading a lot. Uh, it's always come to mind. I keep checking my channel. I try to answer, you know, comments every so often, but my head is just not in the game for this channel currently. And I don't like that. I, I don't want that to happen to this channel as it has happened to my channels since I was a kid, uh, since I was like five years old and well, not five, it was more like seven. And, you know, me running YouTube channels and stuff like that. I do run a gaming YouTube channel uh, where I just game just for the whatevs. Um, and I do upload there. But my real passion is programming. I do like programming. Um, it's something I really enjoy because it's creative. You're kind of creating stuff from scratch. And uh, I'm a very creative person. Creativity fuels me. So I don't want to let go of this channel. Uh, so I'm going to be uploading or try to be uploading multiple videos a week. We're talking about five to six videos a week on Discord JS, so how to make Discord bots, and some other stuff, uh, some other pleasant stuff that I find coding. Um, it would be kind of fun uh, and not necessarily fully coded, cl sorry, coding, um, but something technology maybe uh but mainly coding this is a coding channel so i will be trying to pump out as much content at least five to six videos a week uh if you guys you know are staying tuned to my channel and you see me slacking off please tell me and i will make sure to rewatch this video and you know keep my word from what i'm saying so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video pretty short but i will have a video up tomorrow um and if i you know I will continue doing this. Uh, thank you guys for the support. A lot of support has been going through my channel. The first video has over 14,000 views, like 300 likes, uh, like 270 comments. I like I read them all, guys. Um, some of them I don't answer because I don't have the time to go out and answer all of the questions for every single problem everybody has. Coding is a complicated concept and a lot of, you know, it's error prone and a lot of errors can happen and some errors that happen to you might not happen to someone else, might not happen to me, I might, know, I might not know the error, uh, you might not know what's happening. It's very complicated, but I'll, I do my best to try to answer uh, in general the problems that you guys are, you know, are having. And uh, also I see a lot of you guys helping each other in the comments, so thank you for that. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below uh, a suggestion for the next video. I think I'm going to be doing permissions because a lot of people have asked for permissions. And as you can see here, I was testing the permissions uh, with the roles uh, and the ID roles. But I will try to record that video very, very soon. It will be up and running. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys later on my next video. Peace.